Alright, Ducky, meet you outside. Okay, bye. Say bye to the camera. I don't know if the microphone's on. It's already on. It's always okay, on. Okay, bye, Ducky. Bye. Going outside with the spooge. So yesterday we found that a dog peed right there. Ew. Please don't smell so frisky. Hey, buddy. Buddy. What are you doing? Gross pee on the ground. Gross. So currently we are on vacation. As you guys know, there haven't been a lot of videos going up. I think probably no videos going up. Currently Susie and Lee, I'm pretty sure they're in Thailand. Yeah. Simon and I are going in and out of the office. We're supposed to be on vacation. We really suck at this kind of thing. Yeah. So I just thought we'd put up maybe a little bit of footage to show you guys what's happening because I know a lot of people have a message us being like, what happened? Did you stop making videos? And no, we, we just try to take some time off and like kind of recharge our batteries and think of things to do. But it is very hard to take time off because it's kind of like taking time off of your life as I don't consider going to eat food and talking about Korean food work. But then the editing part and the uploading it and then the computer's crashing and then like screaming on the top of your lungs and swearing at 4 a.m. because something um, crashed. Not that I do that. That. Yeah, that's my story. Okay, see you in the car. Hi, big old man man. Hello there, internets. That was kind of weird. Oh. <laughs> oh, so hi there, memes. There's Mr. Spudge. As you know, we just went walking together. Hey, Ryan, would you? My brother's annoying. There, his meme is dramatically pressing his face up against the netting. Hey, buddy. And we have arrived in Hongdae. Very close to us. Lots of people making the jaywalks in the jaywalk zone. One of my favorite places for jaywalking, so I don't oh, blame geez. them, but at least do it right. Oh, come on. This street <laughs> used to have cars driving on it, and they used to recently put up a sign, which is awesome, because it was like the chaos street is what it was. It's my go. Look at you. It's this is my green light. No, you can't go. No, you can't go. Honk the horn. Why are you doing this to me? Why? <laughs> 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 My little puppy. How'd you go for me, crate? And then you go. Down. Piss Yay. all over that truck. This so you goes to pee on things. I love this graffiti wall. I never get sick of it. We have like the coolest parking lot, despite it being terrible to actually park in. And that is the pop club downstairs, and then we are on the very fourth floor up there. Equipped with leaking ceilings! Na 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 na! <laughs> I have a kitty! Is that Mr. Meemerson? You know, I can't see anything because that's just plastic. I have a kitty! Oh, I see. Hi, Meemers. Hey, ma'am. You're such a good boy. Ooh, ooh. So much time has passed. I believe it's nighttime now. We recorded our radio show and I'm editing my coding video we put up. Okay, girl. Um, that was a joke about the Korean word today. So funny. You're clever. Yeah. This is the barf gate. It prevents people from coming upstairs and barfing in our hallway on the weekends. Because there's a club at the bottom floor and people try to go up as high as they can to barf somewhere. And this is the limit so they won't barf in front of our door. I think it's amazing that they climb up so many stairs. Yeah. We've got a little barf files usually here and like there. Yeah. yeah. Lots of barf usually. Korea. Come to Korea. Stuff barf in the hallways. <laughs> So we're gonna go get um, lunch. Why are people still smoking inside? We're gonna go for um, Biko Curry. Some screaming children to the right of us. Yeah. Yeah. And I know we're betraying Koko Curry's trust right now, but uh -huh. we're just trying to have something original because all we do is eat Koko Curry. Yep. Yeah. You know that song, A Toy by 2PM? All they think of you? You just hear that guy spit? I want to go arm. <laughs> All right, back alleyways of fun. Okay. Um, let me switch my arm so I don't. Look. You're using your wrong right arm. Way. I think the you're back bending your arm a lot more. You're just gonna put it right up into your oh, nose by the end of it. Hi. That's okay. Hi. You're allowed to do that. Hello. I think I lost Simon along the way. So this is the awesome alleyway of lots of little like food, snacky stuff like that. I really uh, like it. Yeah, yeah. Um, and it's like actually less crowded than the alleyway to the right of us, which is usually insane. If you can believe that, this is less crowded. A lot of people don't know about the secret back route. It's the secret back route that nobody knows about. Even like, though it seems it. like a lot of people don't, if you go to the street over, that's when you're done for. Yeah. Going for the 
basat, which is mushroom. Getting green onion, lots of manul, lots of it, and then cheese. Okay. Um, and an egg. No, I'm not gonna put. Yeah, I should put an egg in. I don't know. Yeah, put in an egg. Eggs are healthy. <laughs> A hiccup burp. So spicy that it burped my throat, and then I hiccuped in the fence and I burped at the same time. Wow, thank you for sharing that. Oh man. I love Japanese curry. You guys ever play Super Smash Brothers? <clears throat> you know, when you're playing Super Smash and you get um, the curry, and then your character runs around like screaming fire, and you're like, what's up with that? This is why Japanese curry is hot. It's spicier hot. than any Korean food that I know. Mm -hmm. Those Korean. Instant ramens that are supposedly really, really spicy. The fire noodles have nothing compared to this. Yep. There's something about the spice that's just so satisfying and painful, makes your nose run. Oh. I'm gonna be farting blood. <laughs> Thank you for that. One of the best things about eating really spicy curry or any spicy food in the winter time is when you step outside, your mouth feels so fresh. You feel the cold air in your mouth and it's delicious. It's like right after you brush your teeth and then you have a glass of water and you feel all the coolness in your mouth. This feeling of the cold air in my mouth, this lovely polluted air, so smoggy, <laughs> tastes so much better now with my mouth on fire. Yep. Um, I'm just gonna put that out there. I don't think that this is really good for the car. Isn't that damaging the hood? Uh, it's okay. It's okay. Shut ammo. I got parking. At least I got a spot. Yep. This used to be that Hawaiian restaurant. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. I bid you a good day, sir. Bye bye. You don't have a wallet. I call your bluff. I forgot. I have a wallet. You left yours in the studio. Na 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 na. Almost died. Touchy. Spudgy boy. Spudgy. Spudgy. <laughs> yep, that's me. You can smell me. It's me. Come on, Spudgy. Run for it. Evidence of Rose being lazy in the cave with memers. What? What? And Super Junior playing as soon as we left. So as soon as I leave, people start blaring K pop. <laughs> oh. Last time Simon left, I also blared K pop. Finishing up my omok video, oh, having had that's curry. Fun. That's Sophia you didn't need. Oh, he's yeah, like, why would you put me on camera oh, right now? <laughs> we'll introduce you to Sophia when she's not in the middle of eating the chapchae hotak I just gave her. Can you set it up to also give you like, to send emails to you if there's an error happening or no? Rose and Simon nerding out over new functions that are coming soon. Yay! Yay! I'm back my job Yay! Followed by... Yay. You're so... How did this laziness occur? Hmm? How did this happen? Who let you become this lazy? Huh? Weavers loves the cave because... It's got floor heating. He's pretty happy about the whole thing. <gasps> Who did this? Okay, we're home from work. We're gonna watch Agent Carter, right, Ducky? Yeah! There's a new episode, we're like crazy obsessed with it. I'm making a really good cocktails tonight. So for Simon, I'm going to be making uh, the sidecar, which is like a lemony one. So I'm using um, Grand Marnier, which is an orange liqueur, and I'm using the world's grossest brandy. It's the only brandy available in Korea. It's $10 and I just found it. But I'm gonna add a splash of limoncella in it, and of course, lemon, it's a very lemony drink. And I'm gonna make myself a Cosmo. It is cranberry juice in Korea, but I am instead using the Lingen, Lindenberg, Dittiberg from Ikea, which is meant to be mixed with like a soda water, but I use it as like an undiluted, kind of like a cranberry, with vodka 
and glorious, glorious overpriced lime, which we um, find rarely in Korea, and when we do, we buy like a whole bag full. So that's what we're gonna be working on for today. Time to do some agent cartering. Simon's gonna play Dragon Age Inquisition. I'm gonna edit this video because that's what I do in my free time. I like editing videos, okay, don't judge me. Simon, in deep concentration mode. I've got a superior belt of range of fence. Sorry, can you say that one more time? I've got a superior belt of range of fence. Uh, it's item level 20. Sorry, I just walked right past you. My workstation. <sighs> Cosmo. Down. Buffy, hello. Stuffed toys by the window, how you doing? This is my little editing station. Grumpy Owl, check. 